Yeah, that goes away. That goes away too. Uh, not the Warden Skirmisher. Hopefully we don't get Roach. Camelos, 94. This deck is okay, but we're not really owning everybody with it. I'm a little concerned with that. I need a deck that is just utterly and completely broken. Like, no one can stand against me. It's not true. English is a very hard language to learn. Its grammar is insane. Being able to get directions and discuss philosophy are very different levels. Also, the main main annoying well main annoyance with it is that you don't know how to pronounce stuff i i think that is the one thing that really annoys me the most that and the fact that uh there's a he or she thing i'm used to just just one way to refer to a third person without actually considering their gender whatsoever it doesn't matter it is just so incredibly awkward and pointless. So that's not good. And also, like, you don't know how to pronounce stuff. And people that, that's why people just pronouncing it how the fuck they want. Like, there are not that many people who well, relatively not that many people who speak English overall, even in the UK. And like people just like fuck it. I'm just gonna speak whatever I fucking want. There's there are like a lot of accents. And that's not really uh, a thing with all languages. Yeah, that's annoying. Imperial Manticore. He can kill that. Okay, how about do like a Dwarven Skirmisher here? Never had your kneecaps broken. Oh. Oh, that sucks. I hate that combo. That's the stupidest thing ever. That is the... Okay, whatever. I'm really pissed off by that. <laughs> Imperial Manticore kills something instantly. Then Cyclops kills something and it just, it just literally deletes three things of any power. And now we're in big trouble. <laughs> you can't even pass. That's ridiculously powerful. Alright. Uh, we're gonna play Cleaver here. A lot would be good against that, but obviously uh, we don't have it. And when he plays it, we can actually. Oh my god, really? Game, I think this is over. Should have hit Manticore with Skirmisher. Yeah, you're right, that could have helped. What do we do now? Do we just press concede? <laughs> because uh, that's kind of how it looks like. Now we gotta keep playing. So right now we just simply lose an even. <sighs> Got a hearty hankering for Gwent. Screw that. You're playing. Who's fast? 
And this is a really bad hand as well, overall. We don't have uh, the buffers. That could help us a lot with long grounds. And whatever we had, I could have helped our dad. So this, at most, can destroy a five. Paint. Yeah, I should have just put them on the melee row. That would have worked better. Pass too late. Did we really have a good pass? Oh no. It's even worse now. I'd be the best and last. Yeah, we can't possibly win. We gotta pass. <clears throat> ah, no. Sure, Mahakam Guard doesn't help us too much here. I don't have any way to get resilience. That's okay. Shadow and Skags would help. Not sure if you can find that. Do we put does he play? Of course, why not? He can trigger a... yeah, a death fish. And that's just five free points. This is actually a fairly powerful deck. I came to the conclusion, I, I fought it before, something similar to it, and this is a very powerful deck. Or at least something that I, I struggle beating. Well, if I play Itlin, we are pretty screwed. So I gotta play Sparkler. But if I do that, we can just straight up lose. But this is the only way I don't lose a card. Maybe. He's probably holding on to something that he... Really. He plays everything. Why? So you're telling me you chose to use Osrel this turn to eat my five instead of saving it for next turn to eat a ten. Mister, I don't like you. You. This is hard to believe. I find this weird. We lost, but this was weird. Defeat. GG. That's a, that was a weird push. Seems fishy. It, it was fishy, but come on. This is basically a death stream. <laughs> Not, I don't think we have Camulus here stream, uh, stream sniping us, right? Well, it's not really a dead stream. I actually I f fucking love this stream. <laughs> Said the streamer. But yeah. We can talk about stuff. Alright. Uh, let's see what we get. Not that. Yeah. Not a huge fan. I fucking hate the spears. 
Hadam again with the Wonder Griff deck. <laughs> You're right! Oh boy. Do we like this guy? Did, did you guys like his Wonder Griff deck? Oh, we did learn one thing. Is that... Wait. Didn't we fought him last time with... With, uh, with the monsters? No, no, no. Fuck. I was playing Dwarf so long. Never mind that. I played so many monsters that I'm just, uh, well, I think I'm always a monster. So, let's just go with the Smuggler. Bloody Spear. So the plan here is simple. Come on, where's the Cleaver when I need it? Wow, he's actually committing Wonder Grip's Blade right away. If I had the Monster's deck, then we can actually destroy that. It does have an artifact counter in it. And he very much suspects that I have uh, no counters to artifacts at this point. Uh, very rightfully so. Alright, let's just go with the Dwarven Merc. This is so bad! Look at what he played and don't be disgusted. He played stuff that can be interacted with, stuff that can be interacted with, unless you have a very special card, artifact removal, and a unit that can negate the damage done to it. What is this bullshit? So I can hit that, but it can flip it over, and it's like, oh, what's up? I got full HP. He can get out another one of those. He's doing it. And Back killing my smuggler. Not killing my smuggler. Okay. I'm happy about that. Yeah, he's killing the smuggler with that. So... I can prevent the death of the smuggler with <sighs> Shadow Skags and Pafko. But that's not great. Try and play for carryover. This round is a loss. I don't think we can give up. If he has our as his way, he's just gonna completely own us. Don't you guys remember? He has the cheese strategy. We can't let this happen. Or am I mixing it? the other guy? No, that's the other guy. But his strategy is pretty cheesy too. So I need to get 20 points in two cards. All right, we can go Italy and Eggly. Definitely not hit the biggest guy. <laughs> you can play one of the dwarfs to bloody non-humans. Guarantee a card. What the hell? Oh my god, this round is a loss, but so hard, we have no chance. Zero. What is this? An air counters this deck hard? 
Um, well, we're pretty screwed. I think we gotta pass. Come on, 28 points? How am I gonna do that? This can't be done with the cards I have. Well, this could be 18 points. But. Yeah, we can technically do it. It can technically be done. But that's automatic. No, we can't do it. We gotta pass. Zero chance. You like this deck? I'm gonna steal it. His deck? Probably. <laughs> Who will win? Adam or, Ad or Adam? That's not a bad hand. There's not much in the deck that I really want. I'm okay with this. I'll just keep this. I don't think he's gonna stay a Stay here for long. Because I'm just gonna play a bunch of resilient units. For me, Bilberry's honor! Where is he? That is very surprising. How seriously should I take that? Uh, let's just go with a Marauder. Why not? Yeah, I didn't see him pushing me too much, so... We got out both the resilient marauders. <laughs> You've got balls, that's clear. But you'll need more than that. More than balls? Do we have more than balls? I need to c consult my leader. Tell him something uh, that will upset him. That's a 6 with Sheldon, if we can actually hit it. It's hit something that's relevant. Um, that's probably not gonna happen. Yeah, we're not risking much. Back to square one. <clears throat> so, might as well go with some buffs. So I only have dwarfs left. I can. I probably won't kill Vess. Can't kill her though. Uh, let's just play Gobber Zigrin in the back. Then we can go with uh, Dwarven Merc. So, what other win condition does he have? Uh, that can get strong. We might wanna shut it down right away. Actually, huh? Do I wanna use Zolt and Chivai to take away the zeal? Playing OP immune cards, I see. That's not why I put him in, but I have a plan B here to play him as immune. <laughs> I don't have a choice. You want me to play him as resilient? It, it's another non-choice choice card. I don't know how valuable is zeal. 
I think it could be very valuable. Seem to like Zeo a lot. We'll pay man for Sheldon. What has that witch done? Wondergrift. So this can be a 5. Can it be more than a 5? I don't know. We can blow it up, but is it really that strong? Eh. Actually, I want to play Cleaver as soon as possible. I was kind of holding up hope that I can hit something with it. Uh, but it seems like that's not happening. Make your move already. I haven't got all day. Uh, I should you put him in the back. Oh. Hopefully no scorch. Revenant's incoming. Yeah, that's what I suspect. What? Mm, it's a bit late now. Please play something big. We enter the fray. Oh my god, draw converts everything. Okay, that needs to die, right? That's technically better. Right, right. It doesn't have a lot of uh, targets. Am I dead? That's an interesting combo deck. It works pretty well. How many gold units he has? Uh, he has apparently enough. In the but I'm not sure if it's gonna be enough right now. Seems pretty obvious to me. <gasps> Maybe not. Brokilon! Challenge complete. I managed to beat myself. GG.